you never know what to expect when it comes to a North London derby and that's what we have to look forward to today here at the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, Stuart Robson is next to me ready to provide expert analysis. Stuart, what should we look forward to? Well, I think we're going to get a good game. The atmosphere is always hostile whenever these two teams meet. Let's just hope the players can put that to one side and give us a great game today. They're two very good teams. Number 21, Dijan Kudusevski. Number 10, Harry Kane. And number 7, Son. This is the starting lineup for Tottenham Hotspur. Well, they've got a good front three and a solid back five. But with only two in midfield, they could get overrun. It'll be interesting to see who comes in to support them, if anybody. Good luck. Cheers. Thanks. Good game. Good game. Good game. Hey, good game. Thanks. Good game. Cheers. Good. And so the starting 11 for Arsenal. Aaron Ramsdale is the goalkeeper. Granit Xhaka plays alongside Martin Odegaard in central midfield. And the main striker here is Edward Nketiah. And underway here at the home of Tottenham Hotspur. Nicely timed tackle. And Kessia. Albert Sambi Lokonga. It's with Erdogan. And Ketia has it. Precise ball movement. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Can he take advantage? Well, that effort was always going wide. He's not going to be best pleased with himself. On. and they could really get at the opposition Kane now Son Bentancourt a decisive clearance it was Martin Odegaard An encouraging Arsenal move. Granit Xhaka. Martin Odegaard. And well, a good tackle. Really sitting deep now. That could be problematic. Kulusevsky, Harry Kane, Kane, still passing it around with authority, and reading it absolutely superbly, Bentancourt, now Son, it's gone in, Spurs take the lead in the derby, and just listen to what it means.
Well, just look at the setup here. It's such a clever back heel, but I think the keeper has made a mistake here. While it's a decent finish, it shouldn't go in at that near post. Back underway, 1-0 it is. Martin Erdegaard. And Kessia. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Eric Dyer. And Hoybier with it. Bentancourt Son Poibier Poibier Could be threatening Pass after And no worries for the goalkeeper And Kessia Well, they keep working away, looking for an opening. But then the one that goes astray. Kane. And Hoybier with it. Son. Eric Dyer. Hoybier. Couldn't hang on to the ball. Granit Xhaka and Kessia well they continue their push for the equaliser but definitely not forcing it using his strength to shield the ball and will it be the leveller oh right in the nick of time And getting close to the half-time interval with Spurs holding the advantage. Stuart, interested to know what strikes you about their performance. Well, I think oh, Stuart's a chance! And a crucial intervention inside the box. And Kessia. It's with Erdogan. Xhaka. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. Xhaka and Ketia and a body in the way plenty of players waiting in the middle Xhaka could be and denied by the keeper impressive half time then here in the English capital I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. So the ball is rolling again. Arsenal trailing going into the second half. Will they come up with the right response? Nuno Tavares. And space for the cross. And unable to hang on to the ball. That's good pressing for you.
Granit Xhaka. Well, when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. Just not looking confident in possession. Bentancourt. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Bentancourt with it. Bentancourt. Kane. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Well, the stats don't lie. Arsenal have had most of the possession, but most of their passing has been in deeper areas. Unless they start getting it into their front players with better quality, they'll struggle to turn this one around. Emerson. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Keeping the ball moving. Harry Kane. Teammate in support. It's still there for him. And a goal! They've increased their lead and they don't want to be throwing it away from here. Well, here's the replay, and in many ways, it doesn't do justice to how patient they were in the build-up. Just so composed, waiting for the right moment. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. Second goal for them here. Martin Erdegaard. Granit Xhaka. Very good reading of the game to win possession back. Sessegnon. Can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. Well, the referee not messing about. He's cautioned him. Well, it had to be a yellow card, and he knew it was coming. So a personnel change then. Kane. Son, Rebier takes the shot, and he's certainly in the mood for his second. Well, he's certainly looking a threat, he looks so sharp today. Lucas. And a good-looking ball. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box. Just begging someone to get on the end of it. And then just look at the finish, Derek. He reads the flight perfectly and absolutely smashes it beyond the goalkeeper. There's just no stopping that. underway here and it's been all spurs so far you sense there could be extra punishment dished out showing considerable guile good defending in the end and danger averted for now well in the closing stages and spurs really on top of their game in this one Stuart.
Well, what an excellent performance this has been. They've had complete control for most of the game. Oh, then. they could put it away, Stewart. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. Granite Jacker. Martin Odegaard. Promising sequence. Could cross it in here. A poor cross, all things considered. Could be a chance to break here. Kane. I don't think he'll be proud of that challenge. And it's left to the referee to decide what happens next. And he's been dismissed. This will be a real test of their defensive resilience. Well, he had to go, didn't he? They'll need to reshape their defence quickly here. Substitution for Arsenal. Coming off the pitch, number eight, Martin Odegaard. To be replaced by number 16, Rob Holden. kick needed to be a lot better than that straight into the wall Granite Jacker. well adding up all the stoppages we will have three extra minutes Fabier Kane superb block And with that, the referee says that is the end of the match. And Spurs victorious. Their fans are going to be happy with this. You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent, full of energy and pace, and the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all-round performance. Well, I don't think, Stuart, anyone can really quibble about what he put into the game. Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today.